What's up, Film Jammers? This week, we're taking a look at the Ready Rig. This camera stabilization vest is commonly used to support full-size gimbals. Gimbals get heavy, especially when you throw on an Alexa or a RED with a full-size cinema lens. With a Ready Rig, I'm able to operate three to four times longer, and I don't have as much strain on my back. So today, we're taking a look at two Ready Rig models, the original GS and the Pro Arms Upgrade, and we'll show you them in action on a Movie Pro gimbal. Are you ready? The Ready Rig stabilizer is compatible with most gimbals on the market, including the Movi Pros, the Ronin models, etc. The Ready Rig transfers the weight of the camera package away from your arms, shoulders, and back. It then redistributes the load to your legs and your core so that you can operate for longer periods of time with less fatigue. The base model of the Ready Rig is the GS, and this is the model that we first purchased here at Film Jams. It starts at $1,999 for the GS package. We've used it with the Movie Pro gimbal, we've had cameras from C300s all the way up to Alexa Minis with cinema lenses. It's definitely a more than capable rig and it supports up to 30 pounds, but there is another. Ready Rig Pro Arms Upgrade. This increases the payload of the GS from 30 pounds to 40 pounds. With heavy camera setups, for example, we were recently shooting on the Atlas Orions, having the extra stability on the rig really helps. The nice thing about the Pro Arms Upgrade is that you can extend the arms out further than on the GS. So this gives you a little bit more flexibility in the setup, and it also may be more comfortable for certain gimbal setups. The Pro Arms have telescoping rods, which provide a 24 inch to 37 inch boom range. This also enables you to get higher and lower shots more easily. Another nice upgrade on the Pro Arms is that they have quarter 20 inch threads and 3 8 inch threads. So you can attach a monitor, you can attach lights. We've used them to put different accessories on the arm and it's really versatile. I feel like I'm ready for anything. The Pro Arm upgrade is an extra $600. So for the full rig, you're up to $25.98. You can always purchase the Pro Arms later as an upgrade to your GS vest, so you're not locked into one model or the other, which is nice. So here, the Film Jams team has both the original GS Ready Rig as well as the upgraded Pro Arms. I think they're both great options. If you have the extra cash and you're planning to run heavier setups a lot of the time, and if you want that flexibility to extend the arms out, I think go with the Pro Arms. I definitely like that setup better, but the original GS is also great for a lot of projects and we've used them on a ton of things. You can get the GS setup for under 2000, so it's a more entry level price there. It's still not cheap, but the original GS still works great for a lot of projects. Either way, having a ready rig when you're operating your gimbal will be a huge upgrade to just bear back in it. All right, hopefully seeing these two ready rig setups in action was helpful. If you're running a Movi Pro gimbal or a Ronin gimbal and you're having trouble operating all day, this setup can really help alleviate some of that weight. It has literally saved my back on multiple occasions. It's like my little security blanket. Binky, anyone? Mm -hmm. Mm. Just like old times. Make sure to like and subscribe for new filmmaking content every week. Mm -hmm. Tastes good, actually. I like this. I like the binky. Mm.